a bad situation Look at him, he's got a bad reputation They be looking at us Thinking we are too much Look at me, I'm in a bad situation Look at him, he's got a bad reputation they be Hey guys, welcome back Welcome to today's video So, in today's video, I'm gonna do kind of like a vlog But this evening, I really need to tidy the kitchen And I kind of wanna organize my cupboards a bit better and just do kind of like a bit of organizing my kitchen so that's what my plan is for the evening it's currently friday evening i finished work all that good stuff and i thought why is my phone literally popping off what is going on friday evening and i finished work and everything like that and i thought you know what probably good to start tidying the kitchen because the kitchen's an absolute mess and also i just really want to get it organized like my cupboards have no kind of like what's the word they just have no kind of like structure like everything is everywhere it started off having some good structure but the more stuff i add to my cupboard the more it just kind of goes a bit crazy so yeah that is what we we're going to do today but what i'm thinking of doing is kind of like grouping the products together and then getting like cute baskets or something like that like i really want to go to asda and kind of do like a shop and see if they've got any baskets in there obviously the best place to get like baskets and stuff like that is either like home bargains or b m or something like that but i haven't really got anything else i need to get there and obviously because you can only kind of go for essentials i don't think going to home bargains to buy some baskets is really essential so yeah maybe not do that we shall see like i'm i want to be like the type of girl that has everything like organized like labeled everything in the cupboard like i don't know about you guys but whenever i'm on pinterest like people's cupboards are incredible even like people's fridges like i see people do these like little fridge organizing things where they like their their fridge is like completely empty and they do a whole shop and then it's just like perfectly organized like i just want that to be my life you know but we've got a bit of a way to go so i'm gonna start today start organizing and i'm just gonna kind of film as and when make it into a little vlog so yeah i also hope you guys are still enjoying kind of like the house content like i know it's so crazy in march so at the end of march we got the keys to this house and so we would have owned this house for like a year soon like it actually blows my mind it's gone so insanely quickly but i can't actually remember what my life was like before living here like how crazy is that so i hope you guys and also if you've been here from the beginning thank you so much i hope you still are enjoying the content if you had seen my previous video i've been talking about getting a cabinet for the corner of our living room and basically i've ordered one but it's not going to be delivered till the end of april at the earliest like what i honestly don't know what's going on with these covid deliveries and stuff like that but that is a long old time and i ordered it at the end of january so we could be waiting a little bit longer but anyway enough chatting so yeah it's gonna be a bit of tidying first and then we'll go into the organizing so let's go i've got this feeling i'm feeling you could be the one i see no reason why i should ever let you go mm. i don't wanna wake up if i'm dreaming because you know i can't get enough of this so i've just tidied off all the stuff that was there but now i'm just gonna go and obviously tidy the hob and wipe all the sides and stuff so what i like to use on the hob is i like to use this elbow grease which gets rid of all the like the grease and stuff and then i like to go in with my sif street free shine stainless steel cleaner because honestly stainless steel is so hard to get like actually properly clean um and then i like to use it with this little minky sponge these are actually really good sponges i really enjoy using them and then just for the sides i'm just going to use a bit of dettol so yeah that's what i'm going to use now and give the sides a good wipe i've been dreaming all night bringing me some inspiration never meant to love no one okay guys so i'm gonna tackle these cupboards first now as you can see we've literally just got a bunch of random stuff everywhere so i think i'm gonna take it all out and then try and reorganize it into like a better situation i might give all the like shelves a wipe as well and then in this side we've got just literally like gin glasses with a pot noodle um some like part bit rolls it's just a mess so let's organize that
Okay, so I've literally just put everything out on the side. Um, I need to kind of put it all in piles now and group it together. I'm not really sure how to group this together. Maybe I'll do like tin cans together. I don't know. I'm not the best at this, but let's just try and do something. <laughs> So this is a current situation. So we actually have so much food, it's crazy. Like some of this stuff I've forgotten we've even have in there. So I'm glad I'm sorting it out. So we use it before it goes out of date. So here we've just got some beans um, and then kind of like tin stuff and tomatoey stuff, which I don't know if that makes sense, but I will see put up there. And just like we have this packet of salsa from like one of the fajita kits that I want to keep. So over here we've got like all the nuts and stuff like that, just a random pot noodle. And then I've kind of just put like salt and pepper oil and then i feel like i need to put that one over there and then just random apple cider vinegar so that's kind of i can't really group these things because i don't have many of them but that's what i'm going for there and then here i've kind of put all the like um tall things so like soy sauce a little mini bottle of red wine for like bolognese and stuff like that um maple syrup rice vinegar all kind of like that stuff there then i put all the like little mini spreads and stuff peanut butter here then I've just got these two together. This is corn flour and stuffing, but they look quite the same height, so I'm gonna put them together. Then we've got the sauces and gravy, and then literally all of this is rice and pasta. So yeah, that's what we're gonna put together there. And then just a random hot chocolate. So that is literally everything. So I'm gonna start putting it back in cupboards. I, I kinda wanna get a little basket to put like those things in, maybe. Um, I'm not entirely sure, but we'll see what it looks like when I put it back in the cupboard. So this definitely looks so much better than it did before and I can kind of see everything now and also I still got like so much more like shelf space which I could put stuff if I needed to so I'm so happy with how that looks now. But I feel like that's exactly where I need the stuff because like especially when I had like salt and pepper and kind of like stuff that I used quite a lot on the top shelf it was so annoying so... Yeah, I feel like that works so much better, so I'm super happy with that. Okay, guys, so we organised the first cupboard. That was quite a success, but I just feel like I can't be arsed now. Do you ever just start something and you're just like, why did I even bother starting? Especially on a Friday evening when I finished work for the whole week, but anyway at least we did the one cupboard i was going to do the little um pantry cupboard because it is super messy but the trouble with our little pantry cupboard is it doesn't have a light in it's quite hard to see um when it's dark like organizing it i don't know if that's like the worst excuse ever but yeah i just kind of see me at the moment but i do need to sort out the kitchen because it's actually mess and also one thing i really want to do is like wipe down all cupboards because they're a mess but i also really want to do that as a shop tonight because we always leave it for the weekend to do like our supermarket shop and most of the time we can't be bothered so we i just I'm just making us sound so lazy right now, but um, so we've got a full supply of food for the weekend, but what is the time? It's currently 20 past seven. So yeah, that actually took me quite a while to do that to be honest, but I don't know, let me know in the comments, like what's the best way to organize cupboards because I literally have no idea or just DM me on Instagram some like tips because I'm so new to all this. Right guys, so I've got my shopping bags and we're gonna head to Asda, do a quick Asda shop. I wrote down some kind of like ideas of sort of meals I want for the next couple of days. So yeah, anyway, let's go. So guys, I've just hopped in the car and honestly, I feel like I should go get my coat because it is so freezing. It's so cold. I honestly feel like I've been cold for like the past week. <laughs> It's just absolutely freezing. But anyway, let's go to our star. <laughs> so we've arrived at our star. I'm gonna go in now. It's so quiet, like the car park is completely dead. So I feel like, honestly, when did I ever get so old? Like who the heck spends their Friday night doing an the shop? But I mean, usually like back in the day, I'd be like seeing friends, seeing family, getting cocktails. But you know, now the highlight of the week is the Asda shop. So we're gonna go into Asda now, do the shop. Hopefully it'd be quite quick because it's so quiet and to be honest, this is probably my favourite time to come because literally, I don't know if anyone else felt like this, but at the start of like all of this, I got so anxious, like going into shops and stuff, which sounds so crazy, but honestly, like it was just super overwhelming with all the like queuing and everything like that, all the masks, but obviously now it's so like used to it, but I still just prefer it when it's like dead 
quiet. So that is always a bonus, it's quiet now. But anyway, let's go in. Guys, I love the little candle selection in Asda, it's so nice. I picked this one up the other day and um, love the smell of this one. But I also might get one of the Eco Wick ones, I think they look so nice. But yeah, I love the little home Asda section, it's so nice. Also, it's so quiet in here, it's actually unreal. So guys, I've just finished my Asda shop. It's currently like 9 p.m. I don't know why it took so long, but um, got all the stuff. I feel like I need to continue my organizing the kitchen tomorrow. So anyway, let's go home and let's put this all away. I am so cold. My hands are absolutely freezing. And also just put hand gel on them and they just feel like all crispy and cold. <laughs> we are back home. Um, I didn't actually get too much, but it was actually so expensive. It's literally like, how much was it in the end? So it was like, cost 78 pound for that. Like, there's literally not much in there, but I did buy, like, dishwasher tablets and stuff like that. Honestly, things like dishwasher tablets are so expensive. Like, I swear this is, like, £10 or £12 or something. It's so expensive. Um, and also, like, kitchen roll and toilet roll is so expensive as well, but anyway so i've got a bunch of different things in here i've got this pizza the first time i ever had this was at jasper's house um years ago and it was so nice so i got one of those these are just like the frozen pizzas probably not the best for you but you know you gotta treat yourself sometimes <laughs> so the fridge is fully stocked it's not very organized though, is it <laughs> you get some more eggs? Yeah, I got some more eggs, but I don't know where they're gonna fit. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I'd say that we don't need eggs. Yeah. But anyway, I got some more. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't look too bad, but it's just so like full of stuff, isn't it? Yeah. But that's what we like. Most of the time, the fridge ain't even full. I know. There you go. Lovely. All done. So now I think I am gonna go have a shower, wash off my makeup, chill out, because it's literally like quarter to ten. Like how crap, days gone so quickly. It's actually insane. I feel like Fridays always go so quickly. Like I just feel the days in general going so quickly. It's actually crazy, isn't it? Yeah, it does. So I'm gonna go do that, get into my dressing gown probably, and then come watch some TV with Jasper. Should we watch some TV? Should we yeah. start a new series? Oh guys, we started watching the, what was it called? The Hotel, it's basically a crime series. Cecil. Cecil Hotel or something. It was me and Jasper watched all four episodes in one night. Yeah, bash out. It was actually really good. I mean, the ending was a bit. Well, I don't know. Was uh, it like, they just like it they kind of repeated themselves. Yeah, it could have been done yeah. in two episodes instead of four. Yeah, yeah. it kind of repeated themselves quite a bit. In, but I feel like that's because we were watching it back to back. Like if you watched an episode, then came back to it and watched another episode, it, it wouldn't have been as bad, I think. Yeah, but it was like. It shared too many people, like it's, I don't know, it's weird wasn't it, how it showed like, those different people at the time were like, invested in the case, but then it, it was going through like, everybody's opinion yeah. of what happened. Yeah, it was quite in detail, wasn't it? Yeah. So, anyway, so that's what we watched, definitely recommend it, it was called the Cecil Hotel Murders, or something like that, but if you're into like, true crime stuff, then definitely watch it. So it is now the next day and this morning as you saw made breakfast all that good stuff and I was planning on continuing my kitchen organization but I feel like I need the right supplies so I've actually been having a look on Amazon Jasper I need to show you this actually Jasper's here do you want to say hey hello um and where was it let me find it so firstly I was thinking of getting some shelf organizers like that. Look how good that would be for the kitchen. Fridge. Shelf organizers. Yeah. Oh, no. oh hang on. That looks cool, cool doesn't pattern. it? Yeah. Yeah, true. But I feel like we stack so much stuff. Like, look how cool these look. Can you see that? We've only got one so shelf. So I saw you can do these. Um, that was just on eBay. But yeah, I thought that was quite a cool idea. 
or like there's so many different like shelf organizing things for the fridge anyway and i just feel like our fridge is an absolute mess don't you think ours is that bad i think ours is so bad like i mean i showed you guys yesterday bad. what are you on about i reckon what everyone will say it's bad the only thing we stack is like ham but we've got multiple packs of ham Mm, I don't know. And then I was oh, thinking Jesus Christ. of like a cool thing. I think your mum has one of these. Yeah, and you wouldn't let me buy Not it. Because you said I wouldn't use it. But now I've started to organise. I feel like something like this would be really good for the shelves. Especially the ones that I was sorting out yesterday. What, what in the fridge? No, in, in the shelf. In the, um, the only problem cupboards. With our cupboards are, they're really short, aren't they? Yeah, that's true. That's the only problem. Because like, that's got like would be handy for you to put like the sprays on and the mm. soy sauce but because the shelves are so short yeah true so unless you can move the shelf can you uh you can i think you can a certain amount can't you but then it will make the one below mm. like ridiculously short i don't know i don't know like look how nice that fridge looks like, look how organized that looks this is what i want my life to the be the problem is that's like we just have so much random stuff in our fridge that that's what I was saying. We have it would so much. It would just be such a mess still because you'd pull a drawer out yeah. and there'd just be random stuff in it. And also, like our cupboards, there's so much random stuff. It's quite hard. To, I was finding it really hard to like group products together because that's what I was trying to do. Yeah, that's what I mean. So all, all you're realistically be doing is like <laughs> making instead of that being like a group of mess. Now it's like an organised group of mess. <laughs> <laughs> I need. You to... still won't have a clue where anything is. Yeah, I know. I was planning on sorting out the understairs cupboard. I swear I've done that so many times, but I want to get some like yeah, that's what I need to I want to get some like bit, baskets and stuff like that from Home Bargains, but I like obviously you can only shop for essential, so I feel a bit bad just going into Home Bargains for some baskets. You Maybe I'll order that. Else, I looked and there wasn't any nice ones. Uh. Maybe I do that, but I might just buy some essentials and then come back to it. Once I've got some bits, because I feel like I want to get some, like, I could always just empty stuff into jars. And that would make it look so much neater. What is that empty in there? Like the flour in the pantry. So, yeah, I feel like I want to get some essentials and continue on with my kitchen clean. Oh, I was put myself in the eye. Because I feel like, the, uh, like when I organise the under sink cupboard, that looks so much better now, doesn't it? Yeah, but it's a bit of a mess at the moment. <laughs> We can just never keep anything Yeah, but that's clean. like everything, wouldn't it? Like, you tidy your house. You don't tidy it once and it stays no. tidy. You have but to tidy it, like, every week. It was like when I was um doing the hob, when I was um cooking on the hob this morning, I was like, I don't even want to use it because it looks so clean. Yeah, surprising that quick stuff gets messy. Yeah, though. it does. Especially when you live with Jess. No, it doesn't! Gets too hot on the sofa, just takes a jumper up and launches it in the direction <laughs> of the table. <laughs> yeah, don't you? That's literally why our house. If when you like, look at our house, and, like I reckon, if anyone came in and be like, the thing that makes it look musty is clothes, and it is. Yeah, my clothes are everywhere. To and be we're fair. like terrible for like hanging stuff up. Yeah, so we're, like we put the clothes on the cl drying horse, and then we and just then we like, leave it. We just take clothes off of it. We don't yeah. just take it upstairs. No, you do that. Once a week, we actually empty it and go put it away. Yeah, but I suppose that's how it is, isn't it? Is what it is. I was meant to put my work, work washing on. Oh yeah, you should probably put that on. We're thinking of going for a walk in a bit, so I might bring you guys along with me. Yeah, I don't know where we can go, but I will let you guys know where we go to. And yeah. <laughs> you look great. Fine, I'm having yeah. that hat back. What? I'm having that hat back when we get out, because it's so oh, cold. I'm gonna wear it, so I pick yes, it up, I and now all of a sudden you wanna wear it. I do, it's my hat. Anyway, we're on our way to go for our walk. It is freezing. Well, God. You've got a hood. Why don't you put your hood up and I'll wear the hat? I've got the hood up as well. Oh, so I have to hold their hood, do I? <laughs> anyway, we're on our way for our walk. Good statement. Good yeah, you need to cut your hair. French, I can have a hat. <laughs> um, yeah, we're going for our walk. We're going to go probably to the beach as we usually do. Yeah. Why are you like so miserable <laughs> about it? Yeah, but I love it. That's yeah, right. I might be a bit windy, so I was thinking. Yeah, that's why I need my shower. That's why I need my hat to cover my ears. That's why I've got a hat. <laughs> that's why I bring a hat. See, they always say that girls like steal their boyfriends' like clothes and stuff and their jumpers, but no, Daphne what, steals what my hat. Just, the, <laughs> I don't just necessarily steal it. I just wear it. You never wear it. And I wouldn't the, wear all it. All of a sudden, I put it on. It's like <laughs> I was gonna wear that. You yeah, were. Shut up. 
<laughs> our walk literally failed so much so it's so windy that it's you, you said it might be windy. Yeah. I said we could go elsewhere, and you're like, no, let's go to the beach. I didn't really take account the, the sand. The yeah, the sand was literally going everywhere. We walked for like five minutes, then got a Greg sausage roll, and then walked back. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, that was the highlight. Um, so we're, I think we're just gonna go get a warm, nice Starbucks, and then go home, chill out, and yeah, I'm gonna order my bits from Amazon as well. Yeah, I really want to get some. I need to find exactly the ones I want. But yeah, so anyway, we're going to go home. Well, we're going to go to Starbucks and go home, yeah? Yes. Yeah. We've got the goods. I've actually got a warm one this time, so I'm actually freezing. I've got a soya hot chocolate with caramel. Nice. Oh, that's a bit bumpy. And then Jasper got a frappuccino, which is somewhere down yeah, there. Yeah, I'm just waiting <laughs> to get over if not, I'll drink it before yeah. I go. I wonder what that was on your back seat. Oh, it's a roll of tape. Ah, oh, that's what the tape mm. Hello everybody, so I've just hopped out of the shower, hence why I look like an egg. But basically last week I filmed some clips of me and Jasper, basically we had some cocktails, played some games of Uno, stuff like that. So I wanted to include that in this video because I literally don't know when I'm going to include it again. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy, but I'll insert those clips now. And yeah, let's get back to the video. We're currently having some cocktails and playing some, um, well actually, oh, it's a bit dark now. We're actually playing some Uno, and um, me and Jasper played this so much when we went on holiday to Turkey, didn't we? Yeah, I swear we played like we like binge played it, so many games. I won. No, you didn't. Yes, I did. did I, you? Yeah, I won the majority. Of but we bought these cards when we were on holiday in Turkey like two years ago. That was our last proper holiday, wasn't it? Was it, it then? It was our last holiday, Jess. Well, yeah, it was our last holiday two years ago. That's crazy, isn't it? It's not two years ago. Be two years ago this summer, wasn't it? When did we go? End of June, wasn't it? June 2019, wasn't it? Yeah, so two years in June. That's crazy. It doesn't actually feel like long ago, does it? But then actually, when you think about it, it's so long ago. Um, I'm currently drinking a little, basically, we bought some cocktails from like this local, what do you call it, like a local bar? It's a local cocktail bar that does. Yeah, like a local take, uh, cocktail bar. Delivery cocktails because of Caitlin. Yeah, so you do the delivery cocktails. We thought we're going to treat ourselves. And also, we have recently reached 10k subscribers on my YouTube channel, which is crazy. Woo! That party popper. Yeah. <laughs> um, so we thought we'd get some cocktails. Um, so yeah, thank you for that, guys. It's really nice. But I'm currently drinking a mango and lychee cooler. Is that what you're drinking as well? Uh. I don't know, where's the bottled one? I don't know. It's got to be in it. Yeah, because one of them was darker than the other, so yeah. I one put it in the... I put it in the little Prosecco glass. Is it Prosecco glasses? I don't know. I think they're Prosecco glasses, but I put them in these anyway, because I think they're such cute glasses, and we definitely don't use them enough. Well, that no, just makes you drink last longer, because it's not just one glass. That is true, yeah. So, we're well, currently... Two glasses for the same cocktail. That is true. That one's so nice. That reminds me of, like, pink grapefruit. A little bit. I like pink grapefruit. No, do you not? Be like that. Yeah, it doesn't taste like pink grapefruit. No. Oh. <laughs> Just me then. So it's a little bit of pink grape shoot uh pink grapefruit squash. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I'm so excited to just actually go out and get cocktails properly. Like get some food. One day. One day. One day. I was gonna do redo my makeup because we're kind of having like a little mini cocktail date night, but she would looking pretty good. <laughs> But you know, I can't really be bothered. Jas was wearing little slipper socks, gotta love that. Some tracking shorts and a jumper. Yeah, really made an effort, but Woo. cocktails. But we're gonna play Uno. I feel like I should time lapse a little Uno game. I'll win. No, you won't. You won't, I always win. I won last game. Don't know what you're on about, we haven't played yet. What's your favorite cocktail? I feel like my favorite cocktail is strawberry daiquiri or a porn star martini. The best. What about you? I do quite like strawberry daiquiri. Oh no. Raspberry daiquiri is uh, really nice. What's it called? Oh, what the one we got in Rome? No, old oh. strawberry raspberry caprioska. That's yeah. Ridiculous. We got those no, in Rome. They're called? so what's nice. It called? A mango margarita. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> frozen mango margarita. Yeah, that that's is nice. insane. To be fair, even like a frozen strawberry daiquiri is really nice, isn't it? Anyway, we're gonna play a game with Uno now. Yeah, 
I'm still here looking like an egg but I just wanted to say thank you guys so much for watching I hope you did enjoy make sure you give the video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it because it does really support my channel and also subscribe so you don't miss out on any other videos and other than that I hope you guys have a lovely Sunday evening and I shall see you all again very very soon bye